just talked about this. You have to use the new intro. Uh -huh. Well, hi. Hi. We rebranded. We did. Things are different. Why did you do that? Well, Why did that you change? Different. Why did you change everything on me? I can see the comments section now. <laughs> You're the worst. Why would you change? It's a little rude. Yeah. One, it's gonna be a lot more personable. That was probably the biggest reason we did it. Um, you'll see with the logos and the branding and everything. Plus, but, we're about to go to WorkbenchCon. More on that yes. in a bit. But like, white grain woodworking just doesn't roll whoa, off the whoa, tongue. Whoa, 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 Yeah, it's, it's hard. Kind of just yeah. White grain woodwork. Plus, it's not, yeah, it's not that, I don't know, memorable. It's like, it's much better. Because then you got to remember our name, our yep. our business name, what we, what we do. And then we're just the white grain woodworking people. And that's also a mouthful. Anyway, so yeah, number two, more memorable, right? So Jenny and Davis, make it plain and simple. Just yeah. cut to the chase. That's who we are. Uh, plus, it gives us more potential for the future. I mean, like right now, we're still doing the woodworking business and everything. We're still going to do that for a long, long time. Mm -hmm. But if we get a crazy hair to do something that oh, isn't woodworking, maybe it's what? like metalworking or something crazy like Else. that. We want to be yes. able to, to shift and pivot and do that. But yeah. nothing's changing right now. This is our new track saw. I'm really excited about it. Uh, just needed the tool. Got this giant board of uh, eight quarter walnut and uh, got to find a way to rip it in half safely. My circular saw, I don't trust the accuracy of it to come close to what we need to do. This board is almost exactly 10 feet long and the desk has to be a finished five feet long. So I really need an accurate straight square cut to get anywhere close to the appropriate dimensions that we want for this top. But anyway, so we're going to start on the desk today. Went and picked up this walnut last weekend. Was originally not going to do it out of eight quarter walnut, but I started thinking, crunched the numbers a little more, figured out we could make it work. So, super excited. Um, excited to get this track saw open and uh, make the first cut on this big slab. Well, it's not a slab, it's just a really, really big board. But one of the downsides of rebranding was, <laughs> thought I deleted the YouTube channel. So that was yes. a little bit of a scare. I got a text saying, I think I may have deleted all of YouTube. And I was like. <laughs> all of YouTube, not just our channel, all no, of YouTube. it was just our channel. <laughs> but fortunately it didn't. Uh, just the way that you combine it, you don't care. Um, <laughs> We lost all of our comments. So any and every comment we ever made on our channel to a reply or to anybody, I yeah. think, across YouTube as White Grain Woodworking is now deleted. It's one of the downsides yep. of changing our account the way that we did so that we can manage it uh, separately and just, it's, you don't care. It's not because we don't love you is the bottom line. <laughs> we That's lost not all why. our comments. <laughs> Uh, it's so not our fault. we're not going to go back and remake all of our comments, but Gosh, we will comment on everything from now on going forward. But Absolutely. Sorry if it seems like there's a whole bunch of one-sided conversations yeah. in our comment section. <laughs> that's why. Um, but yeah, we rebranded. So Yay. we are still us. We are not going anywhere. If we're anything, not... we're more us. We're, we are yeah, more we us are. than we were before. So you are uh, getting full on Davis and Jenny, but you're still going to get the woodworking tips and everything. Yes. You're just going to be watching us do it as our business, which is what you've been doing. It's just, yeah. we want to keep our business brand white grain woodworking like to, lo to the local area. Um, that way it doesn't get conflated with everything we're trying to do online. Conflate. Conflate. SAT what words. I went to college. Um, anyway. Um, but yeah, so still expect lots of business tips for how to start your own woodworking yep, business. We're changing. still going to be pricing projects. That's nothing's changing. what we want the, uh, woodworking. Did I say nothing's changing? Part of the channel is going to be, you did. Okay. Like three times. I think they got it now. Good. Glad. All right. 
We have a problem. Mess. More than the usual problems. Oh, this um, is a problem. What's our problem? Um. First of all, we're in terrible lighting. That mm, we gotta start over. What's our problem? Uh, we kind of messed up on some cat ramps. We have an unhappy customer. Our customer happens to be a cat. So <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that doesn't help. Cat but customer. Cats. Multiple cats. Anyway, the cat ramps we made with the bookshelves a couple weeks ago, the cats aren't liking the ramp that we made. It's kind of a dumb move on my part. I kind of expected the cats to be a little more agile, but I didn't know the cats were a little older. But yeah. anyway, it's still my fault. But we had to build a new series of ramps, which came out of our own pocket, our own time. And yeah, so I had to go and measure. That took another like hour round trip. And then it took another two or three hours, I guess. To slap it together and oh, paint it. It's been carpet. like it's been like minus ten the last week or so. So it's like really expensive to heat the garage up, paint them, and then we don't want to paint the house because of the pets and reasons. But anyway, this is kind of all on us. We're gonna go install them right now. Hopefully, it takes less than another hour. But it's just the cost of doing business. Sometimes you're gonna have to do things like this because I mean, what's the alternative? Mm -hmm. Just you get a people. dog. No, <laughs> the alternative to dealing with unhappy customers. Oh, I'm sorry, our problem. Um, yeah, otherwise they're just pissed and they don't come back to you. Yeah, or you try to argue with them. Yeah. And if you start arguing with them, you've already lost. Yep, so exactly. If you want their money, they have to be right. If you don't want their money, you can be right. But if you want their money, you they have to be right. Jenny doesn't know this, but I got her some flowers a couple days early before Valentine's. We agreed we weren't gonna do anything, but whatever. It's an easy, it's an easy win. What's up, Bruce? This is our storage slash Bruce's room. So yeah, this is where the X-Carve lives now. It's on a little table. So that's the prototype for the batch table that we made a long, long time ago. Um, just, <laughs> we, we made a bunch of those and sold them, but then we had one more and we didn't want to sell it because we were using it as like a, I don't know, like a junk table and we didn't want to get rid of it, but this is where the X-Carve lives. All right, so time for the main event. We got our maker knife. Step, step. <laughs> step, step. Stop. I can't do that on YouTube. People are going to get angry. <laughs> I can do whatever I want on YouTube. Uh, yeah, it broke. The uh, the little belt clip just broke off. It's really, really thin. Focus, you. This is the family channel. Anyway, it broke. It's really thin metal. Mm -hmm. I'm really impressed with Jocko and his team, but I'm super, super impressed with the way they handled it. I was messaging Josh from I Like to Make Stuff. And he just said, hey, have you hit up their support team yet? And I was like, I didn't know they had a support team. This is the first time I ever backed anything on Kickstarter or whatever. And so sent him a quick email with a picture and said, hey, it's totally my fault. I was getting into my car. I just heard a pating and noticed that the belt clip broke. And they emailed back within like a couple hours. Yeah, I mean, fast. it was fast. And they were like, oh, I'm so sorry. Please fill out a ticket and we'll get you a new part. No problem. It was, I was just blown away. So... You're probably not watching it, but Jocko, if this ever finds its way to you, thank you so much for ha creating a support team. I think David is the one who emailed me back, which I was watching you back when I was in high school, believe it or not, when you were still on flight test. The first time you were on flight test. Quick nerd moment, but but anyway, thank you very, very much. Really appreciate it. It's, it's just really cool. It's a great cool. knife, though. Oh my gosh, it's so great. I love the fact that it's just a razor blade, and you can just buy them anywhere. They're literally so cheap. You can flip it around, pop it out. It's just... It's great. It's like a normal utility blade knife, but it's way smaller. It's it it acts like a pocket knife. It's just it's just nice because I hate the thought of sharpening knives. That just ugh. Anyway, thank you for creating a great product. Cannot say enough good things about this. I hope everybody that's ordered one gets there soon. to Workbench Con. I'm excited. I have no idea what we'll be able to film. We're going to try to make a video out of it, but mm -hmm. um, anyway, yeah, uh, on that note, we are going to be having a sale on all of our programs. Yes. So uh, right now until Workbench Con starts, which is just so everybody's clear on the rules, Workbench Con be officially begins Thursday, the 21st of February, 2019. And that is the day in which the coupon will expire. 
So you have from now to night when we post this video is the 13th. Mm -hmm. You have exactly one week of a sale for 30% off any and all of our programs. Yes. So Take jump your on it. Yeah, if you've been wanting it for a while, we just doubled up uh, the first two courses. Yes, we made a combo course. So you're literally getting both of the courses that we created uh, for that one set price. And you can use your 30% off on that as well. And so also we have the super mega, me what, what is it? Super, super mega maker pack. Super mega maker pack. Are you a mega maker? No, I'm just kidding. Super mega maker pack. Yeah. That is just basically everything that we have to offer. It, yeah, it, we're like, just check us out. Give it's, everything it's three hours. Me. It's what do, you, what do you get? You get three hours of Skype coaching. We're giving uh, you both programs. Both programs. You get created. a lifetime membership to the Stud Stack, which is our private Facebook group mm -hmm. where you can talk with other woodworking business owners and just share your wins, yeah. learn, ask questions. Advice. We're in there every single day. Who bought what tools, where, when, why? It's uh, just you also get a free good. hat, free hat, and Ooh. some stickers we'll throw in yeah. there too. And then we will follow you on all of your social media platforms as well. So all of that together is 500 bucks. That's like. I don't know, it's like at least half off. So, oh, at least, yeah. So anyway, it's basically everything that we have for a one-time payment of 500 bucks. Just want to throw that out there as an option. It's Valentine's Day oh, next week. Oh my goodness, how, much how do you romantic love me? to just buy somebody a super maker, super mega, maker makeup mega pack. pack. Valentine's anyway. Day is coming up, guys. Anyway, we're excited for WorkbetchCon. We hope you are too if you're going. We're excited to see you and meet some of you, finally. Um, so we just wanted to celebrate and get you guys excited with us, which is why we're giving you, are you high-fiving? No, I have a question. Okay. Does the 30% off coupon work on the Super Mega Maker Pack? Yes. It does. It does. What? That's just like a one, we're excited for WorkbenchCon, and two, we just, you guys are great, and so why not? 30% off. Absolutely. Let's do it. So anyway, um, I think that's all we got this week. Yeah, really not too much. Goodbye. And then the rest will hopefully be fun vlogs of not here. <laughs> okay, bye. Bye.